It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn out. Hey guys, per usual, I'm getting ready for work. But I wanted to show you guys these shoes. Look here. This company reached out to me to send me a pair of shoes and let me choose. I decided to go ahead and give it to my grandson, that little app, and let him choose the shoes he wanted. Because, y'all, he came to me and said, Now, can you give me some Air Force One? Yeah. Y'all know how much some shoes cost? <laughs> but I will give him five, five uh, points. Thumbs up credit for saying, hey, if you want Air Force Ones from here, you can get them. He was like, sure. So anyway, y'all, these are the shoes. I'm going to put the link, the information. And if you like me, you know, can't pay those exorbitant prices for what these kids like it nowadays. Y'all going to love this. This is how the shoes come packaged. Y'all, they Air Force One. They was. You get your little information card about the shoes, the price, and, you know, all that. You know, the price would have been anyway. You get a pair of shit shoestrings. Oh, these are nice. I don't know if y'all can tell how orange that is because it looks like the lights are kind of washing it out. And then you got your shoes. Let me get them out. Ooh. I got makeup on my hands because I just did my face. Y'all know I'm going to work. That's all I ever do. I want to get this off my hand. Let me put a little something in my hair. Because these curls too tight. Y'all, I'm all over the place. I'm all over the place. But I am excited about these shoes. I really am. Okay, because they, I did not expect them to be so freaking beautiful. Okay, this is one. <laughs> Look at that. I'm going to get him over here to try them on and let you guys see them. And it says Off-White Nike Air Jordan 1, Briverton, Oregon, USA. And this is what it, I looked at the original shoe on site and they look exactly like these. Just size 7. They cute. Let me get the other one. Oh, you get another pair of shoestrings. The blue ones. Yeah. They unravel. I don't know what happened there. Probably something in shipping. And this is the other shoe. That is tight. That is tight. That's the bottom. That's the back. And y'all see that little stitching right there? That is actually stitched in there to that Nike. Y'all see that? Look at the stitching though. That is so freaking detailed. Man. I don't think I uh, I ever go ahead and spend that amount. You know, on the regular shoes. If I can get the kids to be happy with, with shoes like these, man. Look at her. Let me back up so the light don't wash it out. These are really, really nice. I'll go ahead and insert a clip of him wearing them, but right now, I got to get out the door and go to work. But uh, anyway, I'll be back, and I'm going to insert a clip of him wearing these shoes. Okay, guys, I got a few new items that I have been trying out for about, some about three weeks, some one I just tried. And I thought you guys, you know, should know before the Sephora sale because some of this stuff is available at Sephora. <laughs> and the sale did start yesterday, y'all. I made my first order um, yesterday morning about 7. And the one thing I wanted was brushes and they were sold out. Those Sephora brushes uh, were $89, 30% off. They were gone by 7 a.m. When I got off work and remembered to check it, they were sold out. But I'm glad I did pick up me some refer brushes they had a, a new brush set to come out so i bought the new brush set and a set of the old brushes i have been wanting a set of these brushes since they first came into existence then this time i think i was watching um uh, oh shoots okay i think i was watching no i think i know i was watching she changed if they stop changing their names i can remember who they are Whew. Y'all, I can't, I can't think of her name at all. But she did a review 
on these brushes. Y'all know the girl. Oh my goodness. She's a, a I almost said contortionist. She's not contortionist, not quite yet. But you know, she does the, the workout stuff. And uh, she's real bendy. Oh my goodness, Alicia. I cannot think of the girl name. But she did a review on these brushes. And I had to have them. So I picked up two sets. I don't remember how the sets came. I know they were. Let me let y'all see while I'm talking to my, you know, self and not showing y'all nothing. But I think it was like three of these. I thought it was three and three, but I got six, eight brushes. So I don't know what I bought. But they weren't expensive. And I really have been wanting to try these brushes out. So I went ahead and grabbed two sets. But I can't tell y'all which set. But you can check it out on rougher.com. And they only got numbers on the end. Like, you see? And on the other side, it has the brush number. So I got the 4, the 37, the 36, 33, 35, the 03, and the 02. And I wanted this brush because it looks like it's going to be a cool line of brush. See how fine it is? But I'll let y'all know how they work out for me. But anyway, I got these brushes. I think there was like a hundred and something. I don't remember the price, but... I got them. So, yeah. That's not it for four. So. Hold on. One minute. Hello? 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 Yeah, sorry about that. Um. Anyway, where were we? Oh, it's done with the brushes. Okay. Let me show you all the stuff that I got from Oddsley. The first thing I got is this uh, Daily Microfoliant by Dermatologica. I really like these. The first one, I had purchased it. Um... I'm not sure if it was Sephora or us I got it from. And this is the regular strength. And I really, really like this one. And this one is uh the it's supposed to be calming oat based powder exfoliant. It's got oats in it. Let me bring it up so you guys can see it. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And I've been using this for about three weeks. It might look real bad. It look real bad. But let me show y'all what it looks like. This one, I don't think I really... It's just powder. All of them are just, you know, the powder. And you just wet it and put it on your face. You don't really have a scrubbing effect in this one. Because it's real gentle. If you got sensitive skin, this will be really good for you. But I'm going to finish using it. Because I like how well that's clear my product. I actually bought... The uh, black one in the Sephora sale. I ordered it yesterday. So yeah. It's a uh, Dermatologica um, Daily Microfoliant. So yeah. And this one is. Oh it's a Daily Microfoliant. But this is the regular one. I think it's based on sensitive, medium, or heavy. The, the black one. I can't think of what the name of it is. I'll show it to you in my Sephora haul. And uh, anyway. Let's move on. The next thing I got is the Dermatologica uh, Dramatic Skin Recovery. It's got SPF of 50 in it. And this, I really like it. Y'all see it got the Age Smart on it. So, I use this as my SPF uh, every morning before I put on my makeup. Or not every morning. When I know that I'm going to work, I'll use this. And it's not no white cast. No white cast. This is the second time that I have this. So, when I saw it on Oxley, I had to get it. Let me show y'all. Ignore the nails. I'm about to go get them done. And I'm about to run to the Sephora to get one thing. One thing that I really want to get. But I don't want to wait on it to come. So I'm going to go pick it up. But yeah. This is the Dermatologica Dramatic Skin Recovery SPF 50. I keep looking out the window. Because it's a bird out there. <laughs> I don't know. He acting like he, he knows somebody. But I don't know him. Anyway. The next thing I got, these are hair products, y'all. Again, from Oxley. This is the Attawa. Yes, the leave-in conditioner. And I have been using this for about two weeks. And it's new at Sephora. I checked. I checked. And you see, I use about that much. If you have, um, usually wear your hair out or wear your hair down, you would actually love this leave-in conditioner. It's, um, I don't like the spray. Let me go and get that out. The it's, it's just what little bit you get, 
Mm -mm. I just take the top off and I shake it out and put it in my hair. Now, I like it, but if you have, um, say you normally wear your hair out and you want to put leave-in in it and it won't weigh your hair down, it's really light. It does not weigh your hair down. I like the heavy stuff that wear my hair down so I can slick it back and put my wig on. But other than that, I like it. And it doesn't really have a strong smell, you would think, with all these strawberries. Um, melon berry hair milk. That's what it's called. It's a leave-in conditioner cream to spray. That's what it says. But I just like mine a little heavy, a little thicker. It's really light. If you're looking for a light weight leave-in conditioner, this might be your product. This just might be. Okay. Now, the next thing I got from Adelaide Beauty. Now, this I like. This is the Beauty... Um, what does it say? Bio, Bio Mint Deep Conditioning Treatment. I like this. It has a little tingling mint kind of like thing to it. And I have been using this. I use it three times. Every Saturday for about the last three weeks. That's what it looks like. Can y'all see in there? It's really thick, heavy. I put it on, put a little cap on and let it sit in my hair for way too long, about an hour. But then my hair is super soft and I can feel the mint tingling. I really, really like this. I really like this. And this is at Sephora. Really. Okay. Now, the next thing, y'all, this here, I got to put a video in and let you guys see this. I use this. This is the uh, Care Care Natural Darkening Shampoo. Six in one, y'all see that? Six in one, great oxidizing, keratin treatment, damage hair repair, volume boost, scalp relief, and it's hypoallergenic. Now, y'all know what made me get this? This gray hair oxidizing. Okay. <sighs> I had hopes. How hopes? See, it says from this way. Let me see if I can get closer so you guys can see that. Natural results. It's supposed to go from here. To here, to here, two times darker. It's supposed to get darker. Let me tell y'all the truth. I have not seen the darkening effect yet. And I have been using this for three weeks. I just put it back in the box for you guys so it would look new. This is what it looks like. It's a pretty big bottle. But I will tell y'all what I have seen. It lasts up really good. And the main thing I've noticed is those little hairs that I thought, you know, weren't going to come back. They're coming back. And I was reading the card this morning. Uh, it says that it's best to let your hair air dry in the sun to have more effects of the uh, the, the the gray hair oxidizing. I mean, it'll bring it back darker. But yeah, as soon as I wash my hair condition it, I put a, a cap on, a wig cap, and then a wig. So maybe that's why I don't see the gray, but I it, it softens my hair. For some reason, it takes out the tangles. I mean, and it's growing in little bitty hairs back around the edges. So, for that reason, I am going to keep on using this. And I'm going to buy me another one. I, I really like this. I really, really like it. And the last thing I got here, guys, is from The Ordinary. Did y'all know The Ordinary had new products? For your hair? Let's talk about it, y'all. Let's talk about it. The first thing we have here is the Ordinary Hair Care Sulfate 4% Cleaner for Body and Hair. I didn't know it said for body and hair. Now, I didn't use it on my body. <laughs> I guess I didn't read that in detail. It says it's a gentle cleansing formula for daily use. I don't shampoo my hair every day. And I don't think I, I want to wash my body with what I wash my hair with. I don't know why it just seems like an oxymoron. I don't know. But I used it today for the first time in my hair because I was so into the care care, I hadn't got a chance to use this. And again, this did come to me from Octoly. But anyway, it's the, the shampoo. It has a 4% sulfate and it's real thin. Let me let you guys see what it looks like. It's really thin and it lathers well. It's just clear. You wouldn't even think it was shampoo. That's just what it looks like. And it does not have a smell at all. But it was really good. It really cleansed my hair. It felt squeaky clean, if that makes sense. And then I went in with the Ordinary Hair Care. It says, I cannot say that word, Benhentimonium Chloride 2% Conditioner. It says, Lightweight Conditioning Formula. I put this in uh, as soon as I finish washing my hair in the shower. And I just let it sit until I completely finish my shower. And y'all... The slip is so good. I could just run my fingers through it and they not get stuck. And it was easy to comb through. 
I really like this conditioner. I really do. The Ordinary makes really good natural products. No parabens, salt. You know, it's just, it's, it's good. It's good. These products are good. Okay. Now, the last two things from The Ordinary. The lights are so bright, you really can't see what it is. But I will tell you, the first one is a Natural Moisturizing Factor H. A lightweight hydrating serum. That's what this is. And these, both of these are kind of loose, kind of watery. I put this back in here too. I say I've been using these about a good two weeks. And you have to shake this one up because it goes clear. But then after you shake it up, it comes to this milky consistency. It's not really thick at all. Not really thick at all. And I just kind of squirt it through my hair, through my scalp because it's for your scalp. You know, massage it into my scalp a little. There's no tingling. There's no feeling or sensation from it. It says, uh, yeah, I want to read it to you, but I ain't got on my glasses. But it's, uh, it's hydrating. It's supposed to hydrate your scalp. That's what it does. I can't read it. I'm sorry. Sorry, but I can't. <laughs> okay. And the last thing I got here is the multi-peptide serum for hair density. Can y'all see that? It's a concentrated serum. Uh, for hair that looks thicker, denser, and fuller, and healthier. And I let that sit in for a minute. The first one, this serum, after it kind of dries down, my hair dries a little bit, and I go back and put this one in. It's just a clear, clear serum. It's supposed to help thicken your hair. And let me show y'all what this looks like. And it's the same process. It's just a dropper, and you just go in and drop it in. And I massage it into my scalp and I just kind of let it sit there. And we're going to see the results of this. But um, it's the Ordinary. And the Ordinary makes really good products. So I will keep y'all updated as to how this works. And that's it, y'all. This is all I want to share with you. And uh, I can't wait till my stuff from Sephora come next week. Did y'all shop the sale? Y'all know that sale. It's, it's The 30% off Sephora, Sephora stuff is awesome. And the 20% off once a year. I waited all year to get all this new stuff that comes out that I usually go by. I waited until this sale. So next week when it gets here, y'all might as well get ready to chill. Because we're going to be here for a minute because I don't act a plum fool. Okay, guys. I hope everyone's having a blessed Saturday. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. It's the end of the weekend, but I still wanna turn up. Yeah, I still wanna turn up.